Hey, what's up everyone? This is Alan, your Las Vegas and Henderson Realtor with Simply Vegas. Today we'll be checking out the brand new community of Copper Ranch by KB Home in the southwest of Las Vegas, Nevada. Copper Ranch is located in the southwest portion of the Las Vegas Valley near Blue Diamond Road. The major crossroads are South Rainbow Boulevard and West Pebble Road. Copper Ranch is a gated community that will feature a collection of 301 homes. There is an HOA of $48 per month and there are no SIDS or LIDS. The lot premiums will range between $1,000 up to $16,000 and the lot sizes will range between 3,324 square feet to 9,944 square feet. The average lot size is 3,400 square feet and the build times are between 7 to 8 months. Copper Ranch will feature two different collections. The first is the landings which are the two-story homes. These homes range between 1,590 square feet up to 2,469 square feet and they'll range between 3 bedrooms up to 5 bedrooms. The second collection is called the reserves which are their one-story homes. These homes will range between 1,550 square feet up to 1,909 square feet and between 3 to 4 bedrooms. If it's your first time here, please consider hitting that like button, subscribe button and notification button. Thank you so much. Today we'll be checking out the largest floor plan at Copper Ranch. The 2469 floor plan. It features 2,469 square feet, four to five bedrooms, two and a half to four bathrooms, a two-car garage, and a loft. At the front of your home is a covered porch. This home will feature eight-foot ceilings downstairs and upstairs, but there is an option to upgrade to nine-foot ceilings only downstairs. The standard feature for the walls are bull nose corners. You will have the option to make square corners. This is a list of the upgrades that went into this home and are not included features. The standard flooring that comes with your home will be a ceramic towel at the entry and wet areas and carpet everywhere else. The flooring that you see in this home is a luxury vinyl plank which is an upgrade. The included baseboards that come with your home will be 3.5 inch baseboards. The baseboards in this model home are 4.25 inches. Your home will also come with a medium knockdown wall texture. This door will lead to your two car garage. Your included door hardware will come in a chrome finish. This door leads to your coat closet. We have a window here in the hallway. Also an Ecobee thermostat. The first door to your left is your powder room. There's an option to convert this powder room to bathroom 3 when you convert the den to bedroom 5. Otherwise what you see here is a standard configuration. The powder room will have a pedestal sink and an oval vanity mirror. And this room is the den. The den will be open and will have no doors. And there's an option to convert this to the home office. The home office option will give you a built-in desk. And you have the option to add double doors to seal off the home office. And there's also an option to add shelves above the desk. And the last option will be to convert the den to bedroom 5. Which converts the powder room to bathroom 3.
We have a storage room here. If you convert the den to bedroom 5, this becomes your walk-in closet. The standard rail here would be a pony wall, but you do have the option to upgrade to these mission rails. And down this way will be your main living area. One thing I highly recommend doing is upgrading to the 9 foot ceilings. It makes a huge difference. This space here is a great room. A pre-wire for a ceiling fan and LED lights are not included in the great room, but they are optional. The great room will also have three windows facing your backyard. And next to the great room is your dining room. Above your dining room, you will get one LED light you do have the option to add more. And next to the dining room is your kitchen. In the kitchen, there's an option to extend your kitchen island. The island that you see here is the extended kitchen island option. You'll also get 6 LED lights above your kitchen island which are included. The standard countertop that comes with your home will be a granite countertop with a 4 inch backsplash. And there are options to upgrade to a quartz countertop as well. Your included kitchen cabinets will be birch 30 inch square recessed panel upper cabinets with a crown. Dovetail drawers and soft close hinges are not included but they are an option. A refrigerator will not come with your home. There's some frozen food down here. Your included interior doors are 6 feet and 8 inches. They do not have the option to upgrade to 8 foot doors. Here with your walk-in pantry. And for your kitchen island, there's an option to install waterfall edge island. The appliances that come with your home will be stainless steel whirlpool appliances. This includes a range, a microwave hood, and a dishwasher. Your standard kitchen fixtures will be a double basin stainless steel top mount sink. And the included kitchen faucet is a water sense single handle low arc faucet. The cabinets that you see in this model home are 42 inch cabinets which are an upgrade. And that is another thing I highly recommend upgrading. This is your Whirlpool range. And these are small samples of what are included in your home. These are your two color choices for the cabinets. This one's the cafe color. This is a partial overlay. And these are the three color choices for your tile flooring. These are the three color choices for your quartz countertops in your secondary bathrooms. And these are your granite color choices for your kitchen. Remember, these are just the standard included features. There are options to upgrade to other colors. Off of the dining room, we have a sliding glass door that leads to your backyard. There is an option to install an 8 foot sliding glass door which is shown in this model home. And here we have your backyard. In your backyard there is an option to install a covered patio made of aluma wood. 
Just like any other builder, your backyard will come unfinished. This means that you just have dirt back here. Most HOAs will require you to landscape your backyard within a year of closing upon your home, and you'll have six months to submit your plans to the HOA. Let's head upstairs. These stairs just go straight up, there's no landing. And we have a window when we come to the very top. Of this side of the home, the first thing we see is your loft. And on this side would be your primary bedroom and laundry room. Starting with the laundry room. It's a bit on the smaller side. You just have enough room for a washer and dryer. And there's also access to your attic from above. A small linen closet. And this door leads to your primary bedroom. The primary bedroom would just come with one door, but there's an option to saw double doors as shown in this model home. Here we have a jump dug that leads to the outside hallway. This jump dug helps to keep the air even between the bedrooms and the hallway. In the primary bedroom, there are no pre-wires for a ceiling fan, nor are there any LED lights that are included. I would highly recommend at least installing a pre-wire for a ceiling fan, and two LED lights at the minimum as shown here. Although I would prefer 4 LED lights. Heading toward the primary bathroom. These mirrors are pretty cool. If you enjoyed the video so far, please consider hitting that like button. It's free. Here we have a large walk-in closet. Two LED lights are included in here. And so are the chicken wire shelving. In the primer bathroom, there's an option to install an extended vanity. This will just increase the length of the vanity. The faucets and the quartz countertop that you see in this bathroom are standard. And the thickness of your countertops are 3 and a quarter inches. For your primer bath options, there are 5 different options. The first option is to install a super primer bath. This option is actually shown here in this model home. They're just missing the glass enclosure. The second option is to install an enlarged shower with a seat. With this option, you lose your tub, but you have a larger shower. The third and fourth options will give you a linen closet to your left and a smaller shower to your right, which will have no seat. And the last option will be to install a window above the shower. Here's the water closet. Surprisingly, a door to your water closet is not included, but you do have the option to install a door. There is also an option to install rails here instead of having a pony wall. And here we have your loft. The 4 LED lights as well as the pre-wire for a ceiling fan is not included in your loft. In the loft we also have a thermostat. And above the bedrooms we have transfer grills. They are essentially the same as the jump ducts. But the only difference is that they allow in a lot of noise even with your door closed. This is bedroom 2. All the secondary bedrooms will not have any pre-wires for ceiling fans nor will they have any LED lights. Bedroom 2 has a walk-in closet and one window. Bedroom 3 also has the transfer grill, no LED lights or pre-wire for ceiling fan included here. Bedroom 3 will also have one window and a reaching closet. And here we're bedroom 4.
Bedroom four will have two windows facing the front of your home. And a spacious walk-in closet here. Bedroom four will become a junior suite if you choose to install bathroom four here in lieu of the walk-in closet. Across from bedroom 3 is bathroom 2. For bathroom 2, your vanity is only half the size shown here, and it will only come with one sink. You'll have three options. The first option is to extend your vanity. The second option will be to install double sinks. And the third option will be to install a knee space. With the knee space option, you'll just get one sink. For bathroom 2, there's an option to install a toilet compartment here. This will give you a door to close off your toilet. There's also an option to install a window as shown here. This tub with the fiberglass around is included with your home. You will have the option to upgrade to a shower if you choose to do so. This concludes my home tour of the 24694 plan at the landings at Copper Ranch in the southwest area of Las Vegas, Nevada. If you enjoyed this video and like to see more content like this, please consider subscribing to my channel. If you have any questions or would like my real estate assistance in buying or selling home in Las Vegas or Henderson, please give me a call, text, or email. Thank you so much guys for watching the very end. I'll see you in the next video.